46 is brought to you by Dr. George Leakes, a Rumps optometrist since 1990, offering full spectrum eye care for children and adults. Call today, 727-8300. News is also brought to you by J.K. Nelson Law. Call 727-9900 today for your free consultation. If you need a lawyer, you need Nelson. Tonight on News 46, a hit and run driver crashes into a house. An animal rights activist speaks out about a case, and scholarships applications are available now from Valley Electric Association. News 46 starts now. You're watching KPVM News 46 with Deanna O'Donnell. News 46, local coverage you can count on. Good evening, it's Monday, March 7th, 2016. I'm Deanna O'Donnell for News 46. A couple was shocked awake last night after a pickup truck slammed into their home on Gamebird Road. A vehicle versus structure accident occurred last night on Gamebird near Unicorn Street. According to a witness on scene, two vehicles were traveling at a high rate of speed when one pickup truck lost control and hit the front porch of a residence on Gamebird Street. The driver of that vehicle got into the other car and fled the scene. One of the tires came off the pickup truck and hit another car in the homeowner's driveway. The witness on scene hit a stop sign and did damage to his car in order to avoid the two vehicles. Nye County Sheriff's deputies tracked the owner of the pickup truck and did conduct an arrest at a residence on Hawkins Way. This is Deanna O'Donnell for News 46. And Highway 160 was completely closed down Friday night as a result of a traffic accident. A two-vehicle accident resulting in a rollover accident occurred on Friday night on Highway 160 in front of Smith. Traffic was blocked in all directions while Nevada Highway Patrol and Nye County Sheriff's deputies conducted the accident investigation. All occupants declined to be transported at the time of the collision. How the accident occurred is being investigated by Nevada Highway Patrol. This is Deanna O'Donnell for News 46. One vehicle sustained major damage after hitting the back of a station wagon last week. A two-vehicle rear-end collision occurred on Pahrump Valley Boulevard and Mount Charleston Street on Thursday night. Nye County Sheriff's deputies arrived on scene and diverted traffic around the accident while it was being investigated by sheriff's deputies. One person reportedly was transported locally to Desert View Hospital with injuries sustained as a result of this accident. It's unknown at this time how the accident occurred. Nye County Sheriff's deputies are investigating. This is Deanne O'Donnell for News 46. 29-year-old Alan Hare and 26-year-old Sarah Hare have been taken into custody for possession of stolen property, possession of drugs, and drug paraphernalia. According to the report, on February 24th, the Nye County Sheriff's Office deputies served a search warrant on the suspect's residence located here in Pahrump. Upon arrival, Mr. and Mrs. Hare were taken into custody, transported, and booked into the Nye County Sheriff's Office Detention Center after items of drug paraphernalia, controlled substances, and thousands of stolen comic books were located at the residence. News 46 will return with your Desert View Hospital Health Tip right after this break.